The original plans called for John Cena to win the WWE Championship, but all those plans are off the table. What are the newest rumored plans in the WWE? Share, subscribe, smash the bell. Turn on all notifications on YouTube because if it's brash and brazen, you know I'm not going to be overtaken. Quite frankly, I keep it prolific, consistent, and dedicated. So what is the newest and latest on John Cena and the WWE title? Is he going to win it? Is he going to tie? Is he going to beat Ric Flair's record? Is he going to win the world title? Is he going to win the Universal Championship for the first time in his career? What is going on? Well, the latest speculation online is this. And make sure to like my official Facebook fan page. That's showing you in over on Facebook and as well as subscribe here on YouTube. But viewers and subscribers, let's get to what is really tuned in. And that is John Cena in the WWE title. Now, we know that John Cena has cut back. We know that John Cena has lost to the likes of a Nakamura and a Roman Reigns. Did I just put Nakamura and Roman Reigns in the same sentence uh, as as uh, two superstars that defeated John Cena? Yeah, I did. But, but, but viewers and subscribers, Jinder Mahal also br- you know, brought John Cena to the limit on SmackDown Live, but John Cena ultimately got the win. Now, over the last year or so, more than that, we know that John Cena has put over the likes of a Kevin Owens, a Rusev, and AJ Styles countless times, Nakamura, Roman Reigns, uh, you know, it's it's like the list reads a who's who of WWE. That's what John Cena has done and accomplished. He is look at look look at what Kevin Owens' career. He skyrocketed Kevin Owens' career, skyrocketed Nakamura's career. He's in his second WWE title match against Jinder Mahal. But let's get to the matter at hand. Not only may John Cena not win the WWE title ever again, but he may not defeat. And he may not beat Ric Flair's record or tenure as WWE champion. Now, we know the real, real record is even more times than that for Ric Flair. But in the WWE record books, it's the time, the amount of times that the WWE says as of now. But ladies and gentlemen, it looks like John Cena will not be winning the WWE title anytime soon. And it's being rumored that if John Cena does indeed win the title, because we know WWE can change plans. We know the WWE can go in a different direction. We know the WWE can misconstrue things. And that's okay, because that makes things ultimately unpredictable. And it's something that we, quite frankly, didn't see coming. But what we see happening from this angle... from what's going on is if John Cena does win the WWE title, expect it to be very short-lived. Kind of like his last run with the WWE title when he went against and lost Bray Wyatt in the Elimination Chamber. But, however, it's going to be less than a month. Cena could win it at SmackDown and lose it the very next night or lose it at the next pay-per-view extravaganza. So John Cena could literally go on a week's run with the title or to make things even more unexpected and unpredictable, Cena could win it on edition of SmackDown Live or at a WWE SmackDown pay-per-view and then ultimately lose at a live event so as to put more eyes on the WWE live events. So viewers and subscribers, what do you think about the fact about Cena not only not breaking Flair's record reigns as champion, but never winning the WWE title now thanks to his stance and his spot in the company. So it doesn't look like John Cena will be facing Jinder Mahal or whomever is the WWE champion. Now, that's not to say that John Cena won't ever challenge for the title again, but it looks very slim on him ever winning any top world title in WWE ever again. Share, subscribe, where I keep it prolific, consistent, and dedicated. More to come from the brash and brazen one.